Welcome to our channel, where we explore important historical events in just 5 minutes or less. In this video, we'll be diving into some of the most significant moments in history and giving you a quick overview of what happened and why it matters. So sit back, relax, and let's learn about the past together. Japan is an island nation located in the Pacific Ocean. Its history is rich and complex, dating back thousands of years. This period also saw the emergence of the first true Japanese state, known as the Kofun state. During the 7th and 8th centuries, the Asuka and Nara periods began. This was a time of great cultural and artistic achievements, with the introduction of Buddhism from China and the development of a written Japanese language. The capital was moved from Nara to Kyoto, which was the center of Japanese politics and culture for over a thousand years. In the 12th century, the Kamakura period began. This was a time of great political upheaval, as the samurai warriors took control of the government. The first shogun, or military leader, was Minamoto no Yoritomo. Under his rule, the samurai became the dominant class in Japan. The Muromachi period, which began in the 14th century, saw the rise of powerful regional lords, known as daimyo. These lords engaged in constant warfare, leading to a period of great social upheaval. The earliest known human habitation in Japan dates back to around 30,000 BC. These early inhabitants were hunter-gatherers, and it is believed that they were eventually replaced by a group known as the Jomon people. In the 16th century, the country was united under the rule of the first of three consecutive military dictators, or shogun, named Oda Nobunaga, Toyotomi Hideyoshi, and Tokugawa Ieyasu, who established a lasting dynasty that contributed to the stability and prosperity of the country. During the Edo period, 1603-1868, Japan was ruled by the Tokugawa Shogunate. This was a time of relative peace and stability, and it saw the growth of a rich culture, including the development of the Kabuki Theater and the Yukio-e School of Art. However, Japan was also isolated from the rest of the world during this time. In 1868, the Shogunate was overthrown and the Meiji period began. This was a time of rapid modernization and westernization as Japan sought to catch up with the industrialized nations of Europe and America. The emperor was restored to power and the country rapidly developed its economy and military. During World War II, Japan was allied with Nazi Germany and fascist Italy, and it launched a surprise attack on the United States naval base at Pearl Harbor, Hawaii, in December 1941. The U.S. responded with a surprise atomic bombing of the cities of Hiroshima and Nagasaki in August 1945 which led to Japan's surrender and the end of the war. After World War II, Japan adopted a new constitution, which renounced war and militarism. The Jomon culture is known for its pottery, which is some of the oldest in the world. The country then underwent a period of rapid economic growth, becoming one of the world's leading industrialized nations. Japan has been a leading member of the international community and is a major contributor to the United Nations and other international organizations. Around 300 BC, a new group known as the Yayoi people began to migrate to Japan from the Korean peninsula. They brought with them new technologies such as iron and bronze metallurgy and rice cultivation. This marked the beginning of Japan's agricultural society. In the 4th century AD, the Kofun period began. During this time, powerful leaders known as Kofun rulers emerged. They built large burial mounds, known as Kofun, which can still be seen in Japan today. Thanks for tuning in. We hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any suggestions for future topics, please let us know in the comment section below. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and check out our other videos.